everybody. So today we're going to be going over a trunk rotation stretch in a seated form. So I have a nice little stool here underneath my bum. What we're going to do from here is drive those heels down into the dirt. That's going to make sure everything's nice and stable. We're going to work from the bottom up. Next at our pelvis, I want you to draw your tummy in, tighten that navel, and make the space between your spine and your tummy a little bit tighter. So tighten that up. Sit up nice and tall through the chest and the top of the head. Now what we're going to do with these hands is we're going to take them and place them just above our ears on the back of our head here. Thumbs pointing down. What that's going to do is it's going to open up the chest just a little bit further. And I want you to really focus on squeezing those elbows back, keeping that head nice and tall, and still driving those feet down into the dirt. So from here, if this is a stretch, I want you to just hold and breathe into this opening in your shoulders. You can hold this for about 10 to 15 seconds and make sure that you're breathing throughout it. But if this is too easy, the next step from here is to tighten up through that tummy, really, really get it nice and tense, open up through that chest, and now really, really slow, imagining that there's a, a pole from the top of our head through our bum into the ground like a carousel pony, you're gonna rotate on that axis, nice and slow. And I don't want you to guys to throw yourselves into this at all. It's a really slow and controlled movement. Checking in with what feels tight through your upper back and what may feel tight through your hips and your stomach as well. So that is our seated trunk rotation stretch. And you would repeat that three times a day.